Mathematics is not only about numbers, equations, calculations or algorithms, but also about understanding. A very good afternoon to all the respected jury members. I am Razdeep Kaur, working as math mistress in Government Model Senior Secondary School, Gidadawadi. I am going to share my teaching aid, Mathy Magic. This teaching aid is basically a scare board on which a number of activities from class 6 to 10th can be displayed very easily with the help of these colored blocks. Students take keen interest while playing with the numbers on the scare board. This teaching aid is very low cost, multi-purpose, eco-friendly, easy to make, easy to use, easy to understand, creative and avoids unnecessary paper cutting. More than 15 activities can be displayed on this scare board, but due to time limit, I will discuss only a few of them. So let's start our with, with first activity that is commodity property of addition and multiplication. Let us do for commodity property of addition for whole numbers. Let us take two numbers 3 and 2. If I add 3 and 2, the answer comes up to be 5. And if I change the order of these numbers, that is 2 plus 3, the answer is again 5. This means 2 plus 3 is equal to 3 plus 2, which proves the commutative property of addition. Similarly, we can prove for commutative property of multiplication of whole numbers, associative property of addition and multiplication like this, distributive property of multiplication and addition on the square board, Addition and subtraction of integers is also very interestingly played on this square board. Multiplication and division of integers. Factors and identification of prime and composite numbers is very interesting topic which is played on the square board. LCM and HCF. Perimeter and area of rectangle and square can also be shown very easily on the square board. And the next important activity is to, to generalize the formula for sum of first and even natural numbers. Let us do this. Let us take first three even natural numbers that is 2, 4 and 6. Let us take the sum of these two. I will try to form a rectangle from this. And the rectangle formed is of the form 3 by 4. Here I have taken first three even natural numbers that means n is equal to 3 and the sum comes out be in the form of 3 by 4 that is 3 into 3 plus 1. If I take more numbers I will get the same result which can, I can generalize as n into n plus 1 that means sum of first n even natural numbers comes out to be n into n plus 1. Similarly we can generalize the formula for sum of first n odd natural numbers like this. Sum of first n natural numbers like this. Addition and subtraction of natural numbers can also be shown on the number line on this square board. On this number line. Next is to solve simple linear equations on the square board. To un make understand the students for the concept of solving linear equations easily. Let us take a simple linear equation x plus 3 is equal to 2. I want to solve this. For this, firstly, I will add minus 3 on both sides. On the left side as well as on the right side. On the left side. This plus and minus 1 make 0. Only x is left. On the right side, minus 1 and plus 1 makes it 0. Only minus 1 is left. That means x comes out to be minus 1. Similarly, we can solve more simple linear equations. My next topic is to plot points on the Cartesian plate on or to plot linear or non-linear graph. Let us do this. Let us plot point 3 and 4 on this Cartesian plane. This is x-axis and this is y-axis. This is origin 0. 
फ्रॉम हेयर आई हैव प्लॉटेड अ पॉइंट थ्री फोर एक्स इज थ्री एंड वाई इज फोर पॉइंट इज थ्री फोर सिमिलरली वी कैन प्लॉट अदर पॉइंट लाइक टू टू एक्स इज टू वाई इज ऑल्सो टू दिस पॉइंट इज जीरो माइनस टू एक्स इज जीरो एंड वाई इज माइनस टू हेयर नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू ज्वाइन दीज पॉइंट एंड वॉन्ट टू नो वेदर द ग्राफ इज लीनियर और नॉन लीनियर On joining the graph, I see that it forms a line. Means this is a linear graph. And if I take another point and want to check this whether it is linear or non-linear, I can also check more graphs. Similarly, on this graph, I can also draw bar graph, histogram, frequency polygon, and many more activities are possible on the scale board. Thank you very much.